All right, would, hey, Eric, would you ever run for office? I, I think I think local office would be good. Maybe uh, maybe a local chair. Who knows? Maybe maybe I could be mayor of Michigan City. You never know. Is this an official? Is this an official announcement? This is the official announcement. I'm announcing my candidacy for the mayor of Michigan City. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I, I, we also got to know. I mean, now that you've come out, you, you believe that Romney is a sore loser. You're very critical of him now. Do you regret voting for him? No regrets whatsoever. I just I regret the uh, the way Mitt Romney's handled the situation afterwards. But if I had it to do all over again, I, I would do it all over again the exact same way. I do. I have one question. One more question before we go, Eric. If Mitt Romney called you or or Paul Ryan to thank you for the tattoo, would you keep it on your face? I probably would. I'm. I might. I might be. I might. I think I'm bitter. I think that's it. I think I got snubbed by Mr. Romney and Mr. Ryan. They, I didn't get a phone call, not so much as a t-shirt or an email. So may, that, that might be what's fueling this, is just being snubbed. Well, Let's I, see that profile one more time. Let's see it. Eric, ju I just want to clarify one more time. You're pro-gay rights, uh, you're pro-choice, um, but you're a, Mitt, you're, you're a Mitt Romney supporter. I was, like I said, I couldn't, I couldn't agree with everything that the governor says we're not going to agree on everything with anybody we talk to. We're always going to have disagreements on stuff. And that's obviously really big things to disagree on. But with the economy being at the forefront of the election, Governor Romney would have been best to handle that. And the, and the other stuff hopefully would have sorted itself out, which no way to tell now.